Here could be an opening for the Hoosiers. The shot, and it goes in. Indiana with the opening goal, 1-0 in Bloomington. Right on cue, <laughs> Maloon Goombali puts one in the back. What stood out to you about the first half of play, Tim? Well, great play here by Goombali here. Just individual brilliance to get the ball back and catch the Goldson lean. He responded right away. Brilliant ball by Vasquez, great touch by Buckner, and an equally clever finish past Harms. Maholic, shot to nine. The second Ooh. one goes through! Two to one, Indiana leads after chaos in the box! You see the mixer, that's the danger area for Indiana. Any ball in the mixer, scramble, scramble, drops the back rack, and he shows his class here with the finish. Back rack with some space, but lays it off. Sarver on the far side. Sends in a cross. Mahalik couldn't quite connect as it goes over. Ooh. Dangerous set piece from Sarver coming. Sends in the cross. It's low. Bounces through off the post. Ball cleared by the Wolverines. Whistle blows. Foul is called. Sarver and McDonald both around the ball. Seven seconds remain. Shot is low, saved. Rebound is put home. Indiana with a massive statement just before half. Tommy Mahalik makes it 3-1 Hoosiers. Second balls by Indiana. You can't say it enough. You have to stay with your runners. You have to stay with your marks. The scrambles and the second balls, that's their bread and butter. A great strike by Sarver, good save by Golson. But Mahalik now, he gets off the Stein too for his first Division I goal of the year. And a really difficult time now for Michigan. So many white jerseys there crashing the goal unmarked. Yeah, Coach Daly's, that, that's, uh, that's just a... Um, that's just a crushing blow for them, and and to now have to come back and score two goals on this difficult Indiana team with three seconds left. So there's the buzzer. First 45 officially in the books in this Big Ten men's soccer tournament semifinal matchup. The Hoosiers have totally swung this game and shifted the momentum before halftime, getting now not just a two to one lead, but a three to one lead with that rebound. Two goals to, to, to just see it as, if we get one back, the pendulum of momentum switches to our favor. A little bit further up the field in the attack. Nice touch. Ball still loose, squirts through, the save! The rebound blocked again! The Wolverines knocking on the door, but denied! Oh my goodness, Bryce Blevins. Ball came through to Blevins. One-on-one -on -one to put... This pair of saves in this match. Wolverines though, sending a cross. Ball deflected. All over to Vasquez, sends it to Blevins, sends it across, the header. Playing checkers. Rogers sends this one high, middle of the six. Ball still loose, the shot, saved, the rebound, cleared. JT Harm says, I don't think so. Brick wall between the pipes for the Hoosiers. Shot from Al Hasnawi, falls through. Harms has it, some players calling for a handball as well, no whistle. Wagner wanted something. Lays it off, Pereira. Two defenders in front, cuts left, brought down just outside the 18. Whistle blows, and it is going to be a kick coming for the Wolverines. Huge opportunity here, just outside the 18. It's a little bit. They're going to check to see whether the goal call was inside the box or not. And this could be a penalty kick. Penalty kick. If the foul's inside the box, this is something they can review. Moment here, and wow, what a call. There it is, the official indication collection of this game. Rogers shot, and it goes in! The Wolverines shift momentum and pull one back. Three to two, now the score. 
well earned by Michigan in these first 10 minutes. They've been all over Indiana, and that could be the break that they need it. We talked at halftime about not worrying about two goals, but getting your one goal to make it interesting, and Michigan certainly has done that. Coach Shaka Daly said the next goal would be the most important. Now his team has done it. A great take by Rodgers here, a little hesitation. Put it side panel, even if uh, Harms had guessed the right way, I don't think he's getting that one. A great penalty. BB's able to run it down, able to turn as well, lays it off to Sarver. Sarver's cross, headed away, second ball sent in, and it's off the crossbar. Mahalik inches from scoring a second. Oh my goodness. Tommy Mahalik, you're gonna want that one back. On the ball, lays it off. Bakarak shot high and wide. Sarver turns on the Jets, gets off the cross. You're right, right. You, you really don't really notice them, but so important. Here's Blevins. Blevins in the 18, fires a shot, sent out of play, corner kick come. A clearance for the Hoosiers. Simon Vasquez re-enters the match for the Wolverines, by the way. Two not on. Wolverines get it right back. Fisher sends in a cross. And it's towards goal, and it's the equalizer. The Wolverines tie this match up at 3-3. Riley Furch heads home the equalizing goal. Great ball, great service. Ball hung up perfectly for Furch. Flick header. He scored similar goal against Northwestern just a couple weeks ago on service. They've done a great job repressing here. Fisher with the service and then Furch with the flick header. Nothing that Arms could do about that. No pressure on the ball by Mahalik. Free service. And then Furch with just a beautiful flick header to the back post. What a stunning comeback for this Wolverines team. Goes into the halftime break. So Buckner, please be careful the rest of the game. McDonald service, well placed. Mahalik on Buckner. Cuts middle, brought down, whistle does blow. Yellow card is delivered. Jason Buckner receives his second yellow, and that would be a red. He escaped the last one. You just have to be careful. You know, you know you have, you're sitting on a yellow five minutes into the game. Tommy Mahal. It's dangerous with an outswinger here if McDonald's had a good service, which it is. McDonald's service. Long throw, near side of the six. Ball still loose, the shot high. Like basketball, you know, you, you shoot one for 20 and then you shoot 10 for 10, you're gonna feel better about yourself when Sarver you shoot 10 for 10. Sarver with a nifty move. That one almost got from here, despite being down a man. Ball into the mix, caught by Harms. You're Michigan. Sarver gets it back, sends in a cross. The header bounces. It was on the goal line. No goal, according to the officiating crew. What a great ball. We're going to review this one, I'm sure. And there the official what does a, blow the whistle. What a clearance by Baker, the freshman. Good win by Hender Long. To be Here come the Hoosiers. Another cross in, in cleared. Bacharach sends it across the header high here from Cassidy sends in a long ball header high ball still loose the header saved by Hart trying to get the give and go it falls through the cross the shot back right shot saved but the rebound goes in the Indiana Hoosiers have done it Maloon Gumbali gives them a four to three lead and he has a brace Great work by Indiana. Back rack sets this play up with a little delicate ball to get behind the defense. They play it back. 
He gets the shot on goal, on frame. The keeper makes the save. And in classic Indiana style, there he is to clean up the garbage. It's not garbage. <laughs> it's actually pretty sweet stuff when you score as many goals as they do like that. State of Success is brought to you by State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. The Indiana Hoosier. Wolverine swinging the ball around. Al Hiznawi there on the far side. It's in high, touched away. There it is, the final whistle. The Indiana Hoosiers are going to the Big Ten Tournament Final. They secure a 4-3 win in what was an absolute back and forth battle. What did it take from the Hoosiers tonight, Tim, to pull this off? Well, I mean, they just sustained their, after the red card, they sustained the pressure 